It's your girl Riva and I am back again with another video. If you're new to this channel, hi, my name is Riva. It's very nice to meet you. Um, before we get into this video, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure that you guys give this video a thumbs up. And as I always say, make sure you guys leave your comments in the comment section down below. Doesn't matter how you feel about the video, we all want to talk about it. Um, also, if you're not following me on Instagram, follow my Instagram. It's at R-I-V-A-H underscore J-O-R-D-O-N. And you already know how I like to do it. I like to go ahead and get right into this video. Um, this video asks if a man can be faithful uh, for the right woman. And I want to see what they're going to say. I'm going to share my opinions. Let's go ahead and get right into the video. Yes, absolutely. I feel like in the relationship that I am current... Lee and I think that we found each other when we were ready to actually give everything to someone else. So I feel that all the shit that he was doing prior to me, all the sleaziness, all the being single, and it took a minute, don't get me wrong, I'm not telling y'all that everything was sweet, but once we got together and he was like, look, this is what I want, if you're willing to do the same thing, then I can give you a little inch more, you know what I mean? Because I had to sit through the bullshit, and I had to sit through things that I didn't like, and when we came to the realization, like, okay, this can work, like, we can really be a power couple then we both changed, you know, and adjusted. So I do feel like a man who's a, a, a hoe, you know what I'm saying, or an ancient nigga can definitely change. Because I feel like women can do the same thing. Anybody ever had a man change? I think the dialogue is what be throwing me for a loop, like, on these, on these um, platforms. Just because, like, I don't know. I, I just I, there's just a certain way that I wouldn't I wouldn't um, express myself or call a man in a certain way. The same way I wouldn't want a man to call me a certain way. Like the dialogue in the like the slang, it really just throws me for a loop. And I'm just sorry to stop the video so soon, but I just have to express that because like I just don't understand when people talk in a certain manner. I just don't like it. Absolutely, absolutely. But I'm gonna tell you, you had to do some compromising too. You definitely had to change some of your ways as well. Like, you know, it's not easy because you can't just go cold turkey. You don't wake up one day and just want to be this different person. Even for the person that you love, it's hard. If you're used to doing things your way, if you're used to being selfish, if you're used to not consulting your partner when you move and make choices, that's not going to come normal to you. So now you look like the inconsiderate partner in the relationship. You look like the person who's not giving 100%. You know, so, yeah, it's a lot of compromising going on. Like, it's a lot of it. I, I, don't, that, <laughs> I don't feel like a man is going to change. Like, if they change, they change on their own time, and they change because they want to change. If they change, yes, they'll change for a second or a moment to make you feel good for the moment or because maybe you caught them cheating, so, okay, I'll stay up under your ass for maybe a month, and then once you off my body, I'm back to doing the same thing. Men don't change until they are ready to change. No female can change a man. That's never going to happen. I don't care if you ride the best bike in the world. I don't care if you I suck the best bike. Johnson in the hey, world. Wait, I don't wait, care wait, if you wait. got the best credit in the world. I don't care if you the lightest Money. bitch in the world. It's yeah. not going to change. It's, yeah, it's up to him. What, what, he what, he asked, what he asked was, is have you had a man change his ways for you? Not that no. I made him. No. I didn't, that wasn't the question. I said no. Yeah. I said I don't feel oh, in, right. in general. <laughs> no. A man is not changing for anybody. No, a man is not changing for me. Absolutely. He changed because he wants not. to. He changed because he yeah, wants to. And the only time a man right. changes when he got caught. That kind of way, like Holiday is saying, can a man want to change for her? Yes. She inspires oh, yeah. him to change? Yes. No, That's the question. That's still, still, still him happen. changing for himself. Yeah, he's making Basically. that decision for himself. Yeah. But you give him the bullshit. Right. That that is correct. He's making the decision for himself. Um, so I kind of get what both of them are saying, right. but I guess it's kind of mixed. So um Mohair was saying that he's not going to do anything unless he wants to do it, but he can do it for her benefit. Mm -hmm. Like he can be making the decision for himself to be better for the girl that he wants to be with, for but, someone he sees being with for a, a long period of time, not just someone, you know, he's you know, bullshitting with it, you know, if for the right person, he's going to want to, you know, change some things about himself to make yeah, it work to keep that person. But I feel like sometimes when they do that, though, when they go around and doing it just to you, like, OK, I'm going to keep my phone open and OK, I'm going to change because she caught me. You know, mm -hmm. it's not really he's trying to just his ego. He's trying to make him feel good for the moment. So he's going to do whatever it takes to keep you at bay or keep you calm I mean, or keep you not all. No, I mean, 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 I mean,
I mean, undoubtedly remain loyal way past any point that they should. And I'll give numerous examples. When you stay with a man just because you're comfortable and and you don't want to move on to the next one, or you stay with him because of your children, or you stay with him because he's incarcerated, or you stay with him because you think he has potential, the big P word, Mm -hmm. you know, like, there's so many women. Well, because he's going to change. Yeah. I think that's a little crock. (laughs) I think that's bull crap. And the reason why I'm saying that is because I think that men do that also. I don't think that's a woman thing. I think that's men do that also. Men stay to keep their family together. Men stay because they don't want to hurt you even though they don't want to be with you anymore. Um, or you can't mentally take the fact that they don't want to be with you anymore. So they're staying to try to help keep to help ease the blow. Um, I think men stay for different reasons as well. But I also think that all these Um, examples that they've given are not anything that I would say. I think that um, I want to see if anybody else is going to answer and then I'm going to give my perspective of what of my answer. I just want to let them talk so we can see what they're saying. Or because you think you're going to change them. Exactly. Like women, like real talk, like men move when they see that first red flag and women should do the same. And I'm not saying women should move like men. I'm just saying like yo, like take a book out Take a page out the book of the person who's mastered it. Well, most of us will never, though, because we're built different. No, 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 no,
Um, she's submissive of me. Yes, whenever he's going outside, he's going to think about it because he knows that he has comfort at home. Now, if you're stressing him out, I don't know about that, right? If you get on his nerve, if he looks at you and he just sees stress and disgust, I can't say that that same man is going to be faithful to you, right? But I think that there's different assets. I don't think that it's just a one size fits all. If he had cheated, he going to cheat. No, men, you'd be surprised. <laughs> you'd be really surprised. Some... Some men that people would think would be out in the street all day and night could be with a woman who just gives them so much comfort that they don't want to do that. They just don't feel the need to. And they're not saying that for your comfort. They're not saying anything. They're just not doing anything. So I kind of feel like all of these women are just kind of speaking from their experiences, which is true to them. But as men as a whole in general, I don't feel like what they're saying is valid at all. And let me know, guys, in the comment section down below what you guys think about this. And let me know if I'm tripping or if you guys agree with what I'm saying. Childhood, and this person reminds you of that. And that's the person you want to be with. And in your head, no, but it's, it doesn't have anything to do with insecurity. It's what just damaging. Just, just because, because you want to be with him, yeah, don't just mean that because, you should be with but him. You, whereas we can't say they're stupid. It's women that learn how to love different than all of us. We all love differently. So for you to say this woman is stupid because she stayed with a man that cheated on her, maybe that's, it doesn't matter. Maybe that's just her time. I never brought cheating. I just want y'all to know Whatever issue they're dealing with. I don't think the person is stupid. I think that sometimes experience happen when it's a person's life and they gotta go through the shit and you know what it might make that person even better going through that drama I've been through um, so much different like adversity and different things in my life that I've experienced everything you get what I mean I don't know I just feel like I had a spiritual phase I had a crazy like you know in the street hood phase when I was like really young I had a college phase like okay did she say a spiritual phase Okay, wait, <laughs> wait. That's a problem, okay? Because spirituality should never be a phase, okay? That should be a constant, but I'm going to continue this video. I like, so I just feel like, so because I've been through all of that, I feel like I'm in all areas 100, you get it? So I feel like what um, makes a man stay with me is, is definitely my personality. Um, I'm very real. I'm very raw. I'm going to be very straightforward with you. Like, I wear my heart on the sleeve. Um, you know, however I feel, I'm gonna I'm gonna express it. I'm gonna let you know, like, nah, I'm not fucking with that. I, I'm I'm basically a whole vibe. That's just what it is. Like niggas like fucking with me because I'm like their friend. Like it's cool. I'm not worried about what the next bitch look like. I'm not worried about what he could do, what she could do for me. Like, cause I'm good. So I feel like it's me. It's my personality. So my per my person, I will have to go with the person. And I think that goes. I think that goes. I think that's that's good. But I think that there's also a limit to that because at the end of the day, nobody wants to be chilling with their homeboy all day, right? Like they don't want to see you in that light at, at at all times. That you're just so cool that you're like a guy. I think I think there's um there's a line where that can be really good, positive in a relationship, and where that can be a downfall as well. The fact that I know exactly how I want things and when I want them. And it's like, if you don't want it, if you don't know how to deal with me, then you can go. You know, there's not going to be like, oh, maybe you got to change. No, I know that this is not what it is. So you got to go. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys feel, um, how you guys feel about the entire video, but also how you feel about what every person was saying as well. Um, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you guys hit that subscribe button. Um, make sure you guys hit that notification bell. I post a video every single day, but the time varies. So if you hit the bell, it's going to notify you as soon as I drop a new video. Again, if you're not following my Instagram, follow my Instagram. It's at R-I-V-A-H underscore J-O-R-D-O-N. Um, I have some stuff coming out and it's going to be very imperative that you follow my Instagram, okay? Uh, thank you guys so very, very much for watching. I love you guys so much. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video.